Live from Washington, D.C., it's theCUBE, covering .conf 2017. Brought to you by Splunk. Welcome back here on theCUBE. We're in Washington, D.C. at the Walter Washington Convention Center. Day one of .conf 2017, Splunk's Big get together here with some 7,000 plus attendees, 65 countries, and they traveled something like some 30 million miles to get here. Uh, incredible <laughs> turnout, it really is impressive, and uh, a great day we're having here on theCUBE, which of course is the flagship broadcast of SiliconANGLE TV. Joining me is Jeff Chancey, who's a managing director within Accenture Technology Ecosystem and Ventures, and Jeff, good to see you here in Washington. Welcome to town. Likewise, thank you very much. You Excited bet. to be here. Yeah, it's, it's uh, certainly been a great day, great first day. Um, let's talk about your partnership, Accenture, with Splunk, and what do you see the future for the partnership? How is it evolving? Well, it's interesting you might ask that, and it's you know, probably the $64,000 question. The future of the partnership is indeed exciting. Let me kind of articulate what I mean by that. We Accenture, we're a large professional services firm. You know, our competencies around Accenture strategy, Accenture consulting, Accenture digital, technology operations, and Accenture security. And what makes the partnership with Splunk so interesting and unique and also very dynamic is the fact that Splunk as a transformational data platform applies across the full spectrum of business that Accenture does. So if you can bring the power of an Accenture and our presence in the market across all the different industry verticals, all the horizontals, and the power of a transformational data engine like Splunk together, you could say, it should be a very exciting future indeed. <laughs> Probably our biggest objective is to really help in Accenture, we call it rotating to the new. So rotating to new technology, and Splunk is definitely part of our agenda to rotate to the new. We are looking to help our clients become data and digital driven businesses by leveraging the enormous volumes of data that keep exponentially getting generated every single day through connected devices, applications, infrastructure, across the board, the internet of things, everything is now connected and everything is spooling data. So we know that our enterprise executive clients, they're all struggling with this challenge that says, how, how do I not only get value out of my data, how do I solve this challenge with the exponential generation of data so that I don't just survive in the market, but I win? So this is really what we're, what we're after as a partnership is that step change transformational agenda with our enterprise clients. So you have this, um, this budding partnership You've talked about all these fantastic opportunities and great potentials and whatever. Um, is it possible, can you focus on one thing that you're most excited about when it comes to the partnership? The one thing I would say we're most excited about right now is, is our security agenda. We all know where Splunk sits in terms of the security market. Accenture Security, our very first joint market offering is the cyber defense engine, formerly known as um, our cyber defense platform. That joint market offering stands to be really what credentializes the partnership between Accenture and Splunk in the market. It's very exciting. Every customer needs to mitigate risk. They must protect their enterprises. There are breaches happening every single day. It's in the news. And Splunk is a powerful technology to help our clients protect their enterprises. So what you want to do with Accenture and Splunk is we want to help our clients take out cost, mm -hmm. so take out cost out of the back office to drive up their profitability and drive down their cost to serve their customers. Mm -hmm. We want to help them protect their enterprise through security, and then we want to help them drive step change value for their customers and for them through internet of things and business analytics, mm -hmm. automating away the work, and driving that value in the market. So you're talking about this vast array of services that you could provide. Uh, we know about your relationship with Splunk. You've got you know, hordes and hordes of machine data, right, pouring in all the time. How are your clients 
you know, putting all that together? How are the, maybe some of the innovative ways that they're pulling these various resources and sources together and putting them to use? What our clients and what we're observing with our clients is with their data, their data tends to reside in multiple silos within the enterprise. This is normal, this is natural. What we can help do with a powerful technology like Splunk is aggregate that data across all the different silos and bring it together in a single view that not only helps the operations staff, as we said before, protecting the enterprise through security and driving that value through business analytics, real-time digital marketing, mm -hmm. using geolocation services, for example. One of our exciting offerings is in the retail industry vertical. So we're leveraging the power of Splunk to understand through point of sale data what product is going out the door in say a store operations environment and also what inventory is coming through the back door. And triangulating that with the real time rate at which product is leaving the shelves, mm -hmm. being able to help those, cust those retail customers actually do real time order management and trigger those events in real time because if you're a retail customer, the last thing you want to do is have products not on the shelf right. that your customers want to buy. Right. And in the case of a grocery store, for example, you don't want to have um, you know, your, your fresh foods spoil before you have a chance to sell it. So if you can bring together the dynamics of what's going in and out of the store, with customer loyalty programs and geolocations, you can actually real time target those customers when they're in the vicinity of your store and say, you know, the broccoli, we're offering you a special, come in right now, come on in. <laughs> we'll give you 15% right. off of broccoli right. because we know you're a customer that likes to buy a lot of broccoli. Huh. And that's a really exciting well, Inventory is everything, right? Uh, in is. Inventory control in this case is what and you're And really talking applying about. it to the entire supply chain. Because yeah. obviously the inventory from the manufacturing side, the con consumer go goods and services side has to be available, mm -hmm. has to be in the warehouses and the distribution center. So optimizing that entire, call it material and product movement mm -hmm. from the raw material and the manufacturing all the way to the consumer. Right. So we've heard a line, uh, I know you have greater, greater insight, greater value. Um, so how, how are you at Accenture and Splunk bringing that statement to life for, for me as your customer? Clearly, if we can bring the power of data transformation, leveraging next generation technologies like Splunk, and I have to say, I, you know, we as a partnership, we view Splunk as an emerging technology. Hmm. Not emerging in the sense that it doesn't exist yet. I mean, they've been around for over a decade now but emerging onto the world stage to really help power the way businesses drive their, drive their business by leveraging all of that data. The secret sauce that Splunk has is that ability to aggregate, aggregate that data from multiple disparate sources and to do that in real time. So if we can drive greater insight into the customer's data, we can collectively drive greater value. And interestingly enough, the greater than sign is a coincidence. It's part of both Splunk and Accenture's logos. Oh, but yeah, right, yeah, so you both have it working exactly. for you, don't you? <laughs> uh, I, mean, I mean, you're known uh, for vertical industry practices. Um, um, is there one or a specific vertical you can think of that maybe where you all have teamed up and that you're creating this interest or some kind of uh, innovative solution that, that you're able to, um, to specifically develop and apply? I mentioned retail and I mentioned security previously. Uh, an interesting area that we're getting into now is in health and life sciences, so healthcare. Hmm. We want to be able to predict and prevent hospital code blues before they happen. Hmm. Now how might you be able to do that? All of the devices, all of the monitors that all the hospitals have, they're all from different manufacturers, they're all spooling data, and most of the hospital staff are using eyes on glass mm -hmm. to understand we have a code blue. You know, you've seen it in the movies. Sure. Everybody's running to, to resuscitate and save the patient. 
What we want to be able to do leveraging Splunk is to apply machine learning and predictive analytics to understand what the monitors tell us that in 15 minutes this patient is likely to be a code blue and how do we predict and prevent that from happening in the first place. I really can't think of anything better than figuring out how to leverage technology to save lives. Absolutely. Well, if I'm in need, I want you around, okay? Okay, you got it. <laughs> we got a deal. <laughs> Jeff Chansey from Accenture, thanks for yes. being with us here on theCUBE. We appreciate the time and wish you success down the road. Thank you very much, appreciate you, it. You bet, we'll continue here. From .com 2017, we are live in our nation's capital, Washington, D.C.